In this example, we have a map of the modern day city that used to be Konigsberg, and we have the bridges highlighted. It may be hard to see on the video, but there's an edge here, 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 and here. So there are five bridges, each corresponding to an edge on the graph that we can draw. So the question is now, with the modern bridges that exist today, is there now an Euler path or an Euler circuit through this part of the city? So first let's draw a graph here. So we'll have one node representing this north bank up here. We'll have one representing the island in the middle. We have the south bank and the east bank. There's a bridge that connects the north to the island, one that connects the island to the south, and then three bridges connecting the east bank to the other three sections. So let's label these A, B, C, and D just for a way to describe it. And we want to see if there's an Euler path or an Euler circuit. So all we have to do is count the degrees of each node. So if we count the degree of A, for instance, we get 3. The degree of B is 2. The degree of C is 3. And the degree of D is also 2. Remember the rule for an Euler path or circuit. There will be an Euler circuit if all of the nodes have even degree, which isn't the case here. But if there are exactly two nodes that have odd degree, there's an Euler path. Otherwise, there isn't. So in this case, there are exactly two of them that have odd degree, A and C, so there's an Euler path. And there are many examples we could find of Euler paths, but all of them would have to start and end at A and C. So either starting at A and ending at C, or vice versa. So let's assume we start at A and first go to B, and then go to C, and then go to A, and then go to D, and back to C. And there we've covered all the edges without repeating anything. We've traveled on an Euler path through this graph. So yes, on the modern day map, there is an Euler path. Not an Euler circuit, but yes, there's an Euler path. And we found one example of one, although you could find others certainly.